In prehistoric times, very little was wasted. There were few people and lots of space. Most trash was biodegradable, so it wasn't really a problem, but some did leave its mark. Shell middens are essentially prehistoric landfills. As populations grew and moved into cities, trash became a problem. It littered the streets, attracted pests, and bred diseases like the bubonic plague. Ancient Egyptians threw their garbage in the Nile, where they also bathed and got their drinking water. How gross is that? Many parts of the world still have these problems. Animals like pigs and goats graze on garbage, but they leave behind a different kind of waste. Around 500 BC, the Greeks established a law stating trash must be thrown at least one mile away from city walls. Hmm, that word again, away. About the time of America's independence, Ben Franklin organized a garbage collection service. Is there anything that guy didn't invent? Recycling also got its start around this time with people who sifted through the garbage to find usable items. However, Americans continued to pollute our land, water, and air by dumping or burning garbage in it. It wasn't until the mid-1900s that we started using sanitary landfills.